Death Wish is a remake of the 1974 film starring the late Charles Bronson, but this time stars Bruce Willis as Paul Kersey, a hospital surgeon and doctor whose wife and daughter are brutally attacked by home invasion robbers while he is at work. And while he's at work, they will and his family and he has the unfortunate gall of seeing his wife's dead body while his daughter is also in a coma. And of course the police ain't doing jack shit about it. Oh, there's nothing we can do and stuff like that. So he takes the law into his own hands and begins to fight crime Punisher style. This movie was fucking good. I did like, I didn't love, but I liked Death Wish. For one, the original Death Wish will always be the best Death Wish, even though I haven't seen it, but again, the originals are always great. Two, Bruce Willis. I actually liked him in this movie. He actually emoted in this movie, so that's a plus. <laughs> plus, you got Vincent D'Onofrio in here, who's also great as his brother in this movie. Two, it is directed by Eli Roth. Eli Roth is a hit and miss director, but when he's given the right material, he can do justice by it. And this is no exception. There is a lot more gore aspect to it. I'm not sure if there was any gore in the first one, but I doubt it because it was the 70s. But Eli Roth will have the gore in his movies, and it's not too terrible. You know, I, I, I could stand it. Plus, there's a torture scene in here because he is a doctor after all, so... Yeah, yeah, that fucking sucked, <laughs> but I fucking loved it. I don't know why, but I fucking loved it. When a doc, when you piss off a doctor, man, not only killing his fucking wife, above all else, you don't fuck with the wrong man. You know, when you when you when, don't ever fuck with doctors, man. Okay, that was torture, but I fucking loved that scene. It it, it shows don't fuck with people. You never know who you're fucking with, especially doctors, all right? So, I got to respect the doctors, though. Fuck yeah. Anyway, <laughs> action is not disappointing whatsoever. This movie gets straight to the point real quick. This movie, I think it's an hour and 50 minutes. It feels like it's only 90 minutes, though. It really is. It really does feel that short. Because it's in and out so quick, which is great. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. But I also feel that there's no need to drag on the movie. So I also feel there's no need to... There wasn't a need to invest a little bit into the characters. Which I'm pretty sure there was in the original. That's the one gripe I will say about this movie. We don't get a chance to know his wife and daughter. They're just there to serve as his motivation for starting to kill bad guys on the streets and shit but I kinda wish we had that just that just that little bit it would have been nice again the little things in movies is that I I appreciate a movie for that's that's not too big of a deal but it, it would have been nice you know all in all I really did enjoy Death Wish because it was just simple straight to the point and the action was on fleek. And I'm going to give Death Wish a B-. So let me know what you guys think about Death Wish down below. Did you like it? Did you not like it? And I will see you guys at the movies. Y'all have a great night.